Hey everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. As you guys can see by the title, today we are doing something a little bit different. I feel like I do, well not anymore really, but I used to do quite a few wedding dress reviews, trying on wedding dress videos. It's definitely been like a big thing a while back. So this is a little bit of a, like a spin on that, but I feel like personally, a more exciting spin on that. I have been anticipating this since I was like seven years old and I saw this box in the corner of my mom's closet. This box right here, it's very weathered. It looks like it's been aged, it's dated, it's a little old. What could be in here? my mom's wedding dress. But today we have permission from my mom to dive into this on one condition. I have to pack it up all airtight afterwards, but I'll do that later. So since I've done a few wedding dress videos in the past, a lot of you guys have at one point or another told me to try on my mom's wedding dress. And you know what? I'm with you. I also think it will be exciting. And that is what we are going to be doing today. And we're not only just going to be trying it on, I have my mom's old wedding album and a few little things. So we're gonna go through that just so we can see it and see the pictures of her. I'm sure you guys are curious. What did she look like on her wedding day? What is she wearing? Yes, it was a wedding in the 80s and yes the dress shows it but before we dive into the main event which is trying on the wedding dress I want to show you guys a few of the things that I found so one being the wedding book so what do you call this the wedding scrapbook the photo album page here's what it looks like I always thought that this would like open up and have like a picture of my dad and my mom but no it's just it's just like a 3D scrapbook. So in here, there is a ton of pictures from the wedding, obviously. We've got my mommy's family, my dad's family, and I don't want you guys to see just yet. Hold on, let me find a really good one. Also, just a heads up, yes, my dad did in fact have a mustache at his wedding. Thank you very much. I will hold for the applause. Here is a picture of my dad and his groomsmen looking dapper and the ring bearer down here. This one is my dad. Wait, whoa, where am I? fingers. Dad? Okay, there he is. There's my dad, mustache and all. It's like kind of like a running joke in our family about my dad's mustache, just because we always want him to bring it back, like bring back the mustache dad. Like nowadays he could not stand any facial hair and we just like long for the days of the stash. Oh my goodness. Okay, this picture. Here we have the close up that we've been wanting. Yeah, he hasn't aged a day. It's really funny seeing these pictures, especially because back then he was like kind of the age, well not, he was a bit older than what I am now, but like pretty close. So it's strange because like if I was to be like in a class with him or something, what would I think of him? But he's actually my dad. Now my parents did get married fairly young. I know what you're probably thinking, well people used to get married younger back then. And I know people get married at all different ages now too. Like there's a lot of younger weddings, there's a lot of older weddings. Um, but I think generally longer ago, the marriage ages uh, for the like the mean of the age was younger. But I think even at the time, they were even younger because my mom was 19 when she got married. So that's that was pretty young for the 80s, I feel like. But to each their own. I see no problem with it. I mean, obviously it worked. So the facts are in the pudding and we've been eating this pudding for like over 30 years. I'm sure you guys are all just really wanting to see my mom right now. So here is a picture close up. You don't see much of the dress, but you do see a lot of my mom. Now the main comment that my mom gets is how in the world is she 50, over 50 years old? Um, yeah, she truly has not aged. I sleep very easy at night knowing that my gene pool has aged as they did and I cross my fingers that I will follow suit. Here's a picture of the happy couple. As you guys can see, we're getting a better look at my mom's dress. We've got some seriously poofy sleeves. The veil we actually do have as well, so I'll be putting that on and we'll be trying to imitate these bangs. My mom's gonna try and do my hair kind of like how her hair was done, so I think that will be fun. Okay, and here is a picture of her whole dress. So it is so, so pretty. I think that it does have a bit of a train that you can loop up and hold, as my mom said, either on your pinky or uh, it clips back onto the back of the dress. I've definitely seen that before, so I think hers is the same. And you know what? Ode to me, the unborn child that she didn't know she was gonna have yet, because this dress is basically a turtleneck, and I absolutely love turtlenecks. So it's got this lace up here, and then it goes mesh into like 
a v-neck and then the poofy sleeves very rueful ruffly rueful rough ruffling skirt here is a picture with the bridesmaids and the maid of honor and the flower girl so as you can see the color was light pink and hot pink so this is my mom's sister right here i literally love the head pieces that all of them are wearing like that is so a testament to the time and like this is super super cute like i love the pink like, me and my mom are on the same wavelength. I also just, like, can't get over how much my mom has not aged. Like, she was 19 in this. It's very confusing because I feel like she looks older than 19. Like, she looks, like, 25. And now she looks 25. Like, she's, like, some strange alien who doesn't age got some more pictures in here i really like this picture i like the pictures where my mom is actually wait i think my mom might be smiling in every single picture yeah i don't think you would catch a picture of her not is this one she's not no she is and then there's this little envelope that we found and this just has a picture of my mom in it i don't really know the reason for this other than just for memories and then also in the wedding rubber maid that we found was this this holds the rings and the ring bearer walks out with it and i think they're tied on like that very cute it's nice to keep this stuff this seeing all this has really made me think when i get married hopefully um i will keep lots of stuff now i know that's just feeding my hoarder mentality but I'm gonna keep a lot. Now this is just another thing with my mom. Basically when she was shopping for her dress, the boutique thought she was so pretty that um, they took a picture of her and put her in a magazine. So she did in fact get into the magazine. And if that's not saying what level she is on, then I don't know. And I'm sorry that this is just a video of me complimenting my mom. It's hard not to. But okay, so now that you guys are brought up to date on some of the pictures and what we're gonna be getting into, I wanna know how the dress looks now, and I also wanna know if it fits me, because I think my mom and I weighed about the same amount when she got married and to what I am now, but I feel like our proportions might be a little bit different. Like, she's always been thicker in the booty than me. <sighs> always resented her for that. Will her dress fit me? So if you guys didn't notice, my mom's hair is kind of all pushed back, but then she has the bangs curled really, really high and really voluptuously. So I have my my fake bangs and I was thinking we could try and imitate her hairstyle but we need help from the expert so let me call her up I'm just noticing I didn't even realize but I think that we have almost like the same hair color now like my mom's a lot more blonde now like very like light blonde but in this picture I feel like we have the same hair color I always wondered where my hair color came from because it's not from my dad and it isn't the color my mom has but like this is totally her color. Mommy. <laughs> Hello. The 80s called. Um, they want you to wreck my hair. <laughs> Are you even going to say hey to everyone? Oh. <laughs> hey. I think it's pretty secure. Okay. And then this is really good hairspray. Because I'm going to need to back comb those bangs. So like if they're not <gasps> secure. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do how I would have done my hair back then. Did you do your hair for your I wedding? I did. And your makeup? I did. Nice mom. Oh yeah. One thing I will say is my mom has always been an advocate of smiling with your teeth in pictures. <laughs> and I was always like, mom, 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 mom. But every single picture, you're smiling with your yeah, teeth. Yeah, I think you're right. <laughs> so I guess you're allowed to Because <laughs> like you did pull up. I have to just section your bangs just a little bit. <laughs> It's going to be a bit of work to get the bangs, like, to stand, to stand as tall as I need them. Just in case you guys want to try this from home. <laughs> I thought I'd never be doing this kind of hair again. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not frying your own hair. Yeah. <laughs> Me too. Like, if that was my real hair I making know. that noise. This is the money shot. <laughs> oh, he, oh my gosh, yeah. This is it. <laughs> yeah, we're doing it. <laughs> it's coming along right now. It does look Me like it. it. This is <laughs> Me, I guess what? This is what you did. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!
look, you guys. Like, this looks so similar. <laughs> <laughs> when I see you out the car. <laughs> I got. I get a deja vu moment when I see you. <laughs> look at my profile. <laughs> I feel bad to even take this no. out of the box. Like, it looks so good in here. So the veil is down here. And we're going to go into the other room and we're going to open this up and put the veil on and the dress on. All right, you guys. So we're in the other room. Mom, you can come in here if okay. you want. <laughs> and we've decided that my mom is also going to try it on. So here it is. And we are going to try and get it back in here airtight and everything. But we're going to have to cut into it. It's the only way that we're yeah. going to get it out. Oh, I can't wait. Ooh. How's it smell? Oh, it actually smells pretty good. Oh my goodness, it smells like what I imagine you smell like. Uh, it, does, it smells like flowers. It smells good. good. It really does. <laughs> it just broke the mouse comes running out. Wow. Oh my goodness. This is a bougie dress, Mom. Wow, I really like the top. If I put it on and the waist is too tight, I'm going to be upset. Oh. <laughs> I'll just say it right now. I'll be upset. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's like a perfect fit, though. Like, Here. that's not pulling, really. Oh, look at how perfect it is on me. Feel my waist. Okay, you guys, I'm sure you're dying to see it unblurred. So we're going to unblur on three, or we'll, we'll, we'll unblur on three. One, two, three. <laughs> Here it is, you guys. It fits amazingly mom what do you think <laughs> i'm having like serious deja vu moment like honestly, honestly when i get a glance yeah. in the corner of my eye like and i see you there you look just so 80s like this is such a blast from the past and it kept really really well and i understand that why you liked this belt because it changes up the skirt so much yeah there are so many details to this there's like so much beading going on up here it's like an off the shoulder with white mesh and then in the back it's all these so many buttons down it and then of course as you guys can see the skirt is insane. <laughs> this skirt is craziness. And then there is actually a um, a bustle area, like something that uh, there was a. Where is the bustle? There we go. There you go. You. That's how I would walk around with it on my wrist. <laughs> what made you pick this dress? It was the first dress I tried on. It was it the only one you tried on? No, I tried that dress on and I just loved it because it was airy and this material was like so flowy and fluffy and soft. Yeah. And then when I put on like traditional satin gowns, they just felt too heavy and so... Yeah, this is dress is super, super light. I really <laughs> like it. I think that the hairstyle and the veil definitely complete it. I think that we're looking fairly similar. Oh my goodness. Like, honestly, I am getting serious deja vu when I see like, your hair like this. Here's the picture. Turn your right shoulder back. <laughs> see how she is? <laughs> I know it's weird. <laughs> That's it, Mia. That is Ew. the pose. We're going to go and put my mom into the dress now so we can see how she looks in it. First, I need to give something back. <laughs> Yay! It's glued to my head. <laughs> oh yeah, now I feel right. She's in it. Yay! Veil. You sure Mia? you need the bow? <laughs> I'll just stand with my <laughs> Mia. It's on. <laughs> oh yeah, I love it. Woo! Would you pick it again? I probably would. I think it's really <laughs> poofy and fun. Like look at who doesn't love all this fabric. Yeah, no, it's super right? fun. My, oh, there. My bangs were a little far back. That looks better. <laughs> there, that made the difference. Mia. Oh, yeah. It's that's that's better. Better. <laughs> I was wondering what was missing. <laughs> Mom, I feel like a bit of a marshmallow. Mia. Say goodbye. All right, you guys, I am back in my mom's dress for the outro. I'm so, so happy to have finally done this. I feel like I've been curious for a very long time how it would fit and how it would look. Also, 
it's a little itchy around the neck. Like my mom's a trooper. If this was as itchy as it is now back then. Honestly though, the detail is worth it. Like this is one of the prettiest parts of the dress. I feel like it has so much detail and so much embroidery and lace and just all these ruffles. It's such a fun, fun dress. I definitely can see why she chose it. Love the veil. The hair is very 80s and I'm happy to have put it on, put it on because it's a clip and bang. To any of you guys who were curious about what my mom's wedding dress looked like and what it would look like on me, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope it was entertaining for you. I can't believe how well this fits. Like 100% my mom and I were the exact same size at the same age. So that is absolutely crazy, honestly. I mean, I guess it makes sense because we're related, but it's still surprising to me. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.